So we're just going to do a simple factory uh, swap out of this Squire CB50's Tele factory bridge to a nice Wilkinson uh, of almost, it's almost identical, except it's got the nice brass saddles. Let me see if I can adjust this light here. So yeah, it's got these nice brass compensated saddles that I like. And... Uh, and it's a little shinier. I'm going to try to keep it clean as possible. But I've had a real hard time keeping this factory one clean. Um, for one, it's underneath the, the, the strings and you can't really get to it. And I don't know how it got that dirty in the first place. So let's grab a screwdriver and take it up. Remove these four screws here. All right, let's compare the screws that we got with the Wilkinson with... The factory ones they look pretty close so I'm just gonna probably go ahead and use the ones that came with the Wilkinson but first we got to remove this pickup try not to muck up any chrome here get everything aligned nice and just take it easy and not scratch the chrome of the Wilkinson and I just want to get it started really oh see that's what I was afraid of slipping let's get it back aligned come on now all right now every, all the holes look like they line up nice and I said I was going to use the factory screw, the, the screws from Wilkinson. This is a real easy job if you ever want to switch one of these out. You got four screws plus the three pickup screws, and then you got to adjust for intonation. Now that I've got it screwed in there, it's nice and and of course, I didn't check to see if my gr bridge ground was still nice and aligned. And I'll find out if it isn't here shortly. So it's that easy. And everything lined up perfectly. And it looks almost identical to this. Just a lot nicer and cleaner and brighter. And I'm going to put some strings on it. Clean it up a little bit and fire it up. So that's it. Too easy. Drops right in. Everything lines up perfectly. Um... I suggest if you change out, you might want to take some uh, ballpark measurements on your saddle so you can get as close to the saddle coming off as possible to save yourself some time when you intonate it. This has been an, a nice uh, aesthetic upgrade to this CB Tele. The old bridge was kind of dull and dirty, as I mentioned, and uh, this one's all bright and shiny and pretty. Plus, as you can see right there, you can top load this thing as well as load it through a body if you wanted to. As far as tonal difference, I've watched plenty of videos on YouTube that uh, compared vintage uh, to a steel saddle bridge. And every one of them to me sounds like the brass sounds a little rounder, a little warmer, a little fuller. But honestly, I didn't do enough comparing or recording with this thing when it had the old saddle on to honestly say that I can tell a huge tonal difference in it but it does feel good on there the grub screws uh, don't rub into your hand and everything just it feels good it feels good and looks good and sounds good and as long as those three things are present I'm cool with it so until next time please like and subscribe and I'll leave some links down in the description of the video uh, telling you where you can pick this saddle up if you want to make the same modification upgrade. Until next time, we'll see you on the flip side.